there's nothing inherently unhealthy about a, a vegetarian diet so long as you do it consciously. Most people, when they make a switch from uh, meat based to a plant-based diet, they simply just swap out meat for their favorite plant. But that favorite plant may not be complete in its amino acid profile. You can't just eat beans and rely on beans. Whereas if you're an omnivore, you can just eat a three ounce steak and you get everything covered in, in one shot. By comparing the vegetarian diet, does that mean you're increasing the fiber content? If you are, then you're definitely going to have a difference in the gut microbiota. If the fiber is kept constant, but you're just changing carbohydrate, you know, other carbohydrates, starchy carbohydrates, you'll induce a different kind of microbiota change. So it, it really depends um, what aspect in these test studies is actually the difference between the omnivore and, and vegetarian diet. But yes, you do see gut microbiome changes. Unfortunately, uh, what better science has shown us is that there actually is no one size fits all. Um, multiple studies in, in humans have shown that no two people will respond the same to the same diet. None of us had the same body chemistry. Our, how we were born, were we born by C-section or vaginal, were we breastfed or were we bottle fed, all those things sort of um, affect the provenance of, of our microbiome and how we will respond later in life to the foods that we're introduced to. Everybody would love to see a tailored um, microbial consortia that is for specific diseases, not even disease, optimal health, but uh, I, we are a long, a long ways off from that.